Hello everyone, Johnny here. Today in this session we will try to discuss about the difference between sum of 2, 3 and sum of 2 comma 3. So let us understand what is the difference uh, between this using JavaScript. See, currying is an advanced technique of working with the functions. Like it is not only used in JavaScript but it can be used in other languages as well. So before understanding about what is currying, let us understand the functions and the basic concepts of it and let us jump into the concept of currying. F initially we have a concept called arity. Arity means it refers the number of arguments that a function can take. For example, if a function can take two arguments, let us write me let us take me some sample part. For example, if a function can take two arguments that is two parameters from this values we call this one as two arity function for suppose if the same function if the same function is able to take three parameters for example I am trying to take another function now for example as assume I am trying to take another function if it is trying to accept three arguments we call it as three arity function so now we can conclude arity means it refers to the number of arguments that a function can take so for example see here I'm just now I'm trying to take a function here just let me take a function here I'm trying to take a function and I'm trying to pass three parameters now in this I'm trying to return a a plus b plus c for this I'm trying to pass three values like let me write console.log sorry add so it's as javascript is case sensitive 1 comma 2 now if you are trying to write the code for this what will be the output of the snippet if you can see here let me resize this yes so if you can see the output of the snippet you can press f2 also we got nan why did we get nan here because we have passed only two values for example if I am trying to pass three values here sorry for this uh, if I am trying to pass three values we got six see for the first I am let me take a different use cases of this function so control C S so I am trying to pass first two arguments next three arguments and next I am trying to pass multiple arguments like more than like more than this so what will be the output of the snippet let us check the out screen so now uh, if I'm trying to see here uh, let me save this file yes we got it so uh, whenever you are trying to pass less values it is giving us nan nan means not a number and when we are trying to pass the equal values of the same uh, parameters or the arguments it is trying to add it if you are trying to pass more arguments it is going to truncate so extra parameters will be ignored here so this is how the basic function will work now let us understand how this concept will be related to this curry let me take one more example now let me, let me put this in the comments I have placed this in comments and let me write the code now in this I am trying to take a tutorial like I, I will be using arrow functions here let tutorial equals to let me pass two values like name and location I am trying to use arrow function here with two value that is name and location and I am trying to print it like name if you are uh, if you doesn't know this arrow function you can see the link below in the description part and I am trying to write location for it like a location location ok so now I am trying to print the values of it I just want to print the values can you see here I am trying to take an arrow function the function name is tutorial and I am trying to take two parameters that is a name and location and I am trying to pass those values that two arguments like I am trying to call this thing so here I am trying to pass Johnny and next value is Hyderabad I'm trying to take Hyderabad here. 
so let me resize this yes 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 so now uh, I have taken something like this in this uh, let us check the snippet output of the snippet I got Johnny tutorials Hyderabad location so it is trying to pass this values so this is how we have done with a simple arrow function like we have taken a function two parameters and we are trying to pass two arguments to it and it is trying to retrieve that now if I want to make sure this tutorial function will try to return the name in turn it will try to return the location now I'm trying to take the same thing in a different way like I'm trying to take the same thing let me write the same example let me write the same example see here I'm trying to take the same example if you can differentiate it you will understand now I'm trying to take let tutorial sorry for this it's ca getting caps as JavaScript is case sensitive let tutorial equals to name some function again I'm trying to take some function here now in this I'm trying to pass name plus location let me uh, copy the same snippet now I'm trying to take name tutorials location and I'm trying to use Johnny as well as Hyderabad in this if you see the tutorial is about to take name Johnny and in return it is trying to return other function that is location we can say this as a chaining of functions for example I'm trying to write this in this way now we can now we can understand like how this sum of two and sum of three has been written. If you can look into the snippet, I have taken the function tutorial. Again, I'm trying to pass name, location. It means we are just trying to change the functions here. If you can see, we got this. For example, let me write let me erase this. Let me write this so that we can understand. Yes, we got the output. So here we can see we are trying to uh, create uh, return a function that takes the location. First, it is trying to take name Johnny, and next it is trying to return the same function with a location. So here we are trying to change the functions. Now, if I want to break this function, if I want to break this function, we can also write in this way. Can you see this question? Like sum of two and sum of two comma three. In the same way, we are trying to pass a strings here. That is the name and the location. Now let me break the same snippet. Let me break the same snippet now I'm trying to take I'm trying to take the same one and I'm trying to segregate it see I'm trying to take tutorial name location and tutorials that is the location now in this what I'm trying to do is that I'm just trying to take like this like console.log let t equals to tutorial the function we are passing Johnny here we are passing Johnny so in this console.log I am trying to pass t which is in turn returning the Johnny here so we can say uh, this can be easily done using the closure uh, let me check the output of the snippet yes yes we got it so this is how we have done with a basic example now if you can see here we are trying to pass first one the tutorial with Johnny and later on we are trying to pass Hyderabad now if uh, if it is little bit confused like if you are unable to understand let us elaborate into one more uh, program like how we can differentiate between this two and three let us take one more example now see here let us assume the same example better sum of 2 comma 3 and sum of 2 and 3 so in this I am trying to write the code see here now what I am trying to do is that I am trying to take a small function which accepts three values that is uh, three values in the sense a b c and I am trying to make sure that it will try to implement this currying let me take a function now let me take a function now for example I am trying to write function add a comma b comma c let me elaborate this in the simple simpler way and I'm trying to return a plus b plus c so for example if I want to write the snippet what I will do console.log 
uh, I will be calling this and I will be passing the arguments to comma 3 comma 4 so now if you can see here we got 9 so this is how we used to do in earlier now if I want to implement the same code the same snippet in the example of using current, fun current version so let us see how we can do this thing let us see the same snippet how we can do this thing so I'm trying to write the same snippet now so this is how we have written the same function let me elaborate the same thing using curry for example I'm trying to write function add in this I'm trying to write a as I told you currying is nothing but a function which takes uh, an argument and in, in return it will try to take one more thing so I'm trying to write return b and it is trying to return 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 c and in turn it is trying to return a plus b plus c a plus b plus c so it is trying to take it in this way so same snippet we are trying to write using curry now console.log of add that is 1 comma 2 comma 3 so this is how we used to, done, uh, used to do in previous example now we will be trying to use this let us uh, uh, differentiate among these two in our previous example we have taken Johnny and Hyderabad here we are trying to take numbers now there we have concatenated now we have trying to add it here as it is a number now if we can see let us check the output of the snippet yes we got 6 so this is how we can implement curry so if we can see here we have created a function here that is add and we are trying to call the multiple function calls that is using one single function it has been turned into series of functions this can be easily done by closure that is it can access outer function variables and the parameters so let me see let us check into the presentation part so that we can elaborate it in a much clearly so this is how we do a closure so let us uh, look into the presentation part so today we were discussing about currying in javascript so currying is nothing but evaluating a multiple arguments into a single cpm function that is with a single argument for example i have taken a uh, function with three parameters in the currying we can write like this return of function and return of function and return a plus b plus c and here a and b will be returned using the closure that it is able to access outer function parameters so here we are trying to retrieve it that is the first it will take the argument of this thing and it will try to return to the next argument in which the function will take as a thir third argument so the series of the functions will be passing like this and the last function will try to give us the result to all its arguments so let us see we have discussed about arity that is function a comma b and function a comma b comma c if it has two arguments or that is two parameters if it can take two arguments we can take it as two arity function if it can take three uh, arguments we can see it as three arity function now we have done this thing a simple function followed by three parameters that is three arguments to the parameters and two arguments to the parameters and four arguments to the parameters if it has more than the parameters then it will try to truncate in the sense it will be ignored so you can see here this multiple arguments in the it are trying to take in a single way now let us see this example we have done this one like we have taken a function and it is trying to retrieve in this way the same thing we were trying to implement using this thing like tutorial johnny and hyderabad the same thing we have elaborated in this way also we can break into this snippets now if we can look into this example this will be the third version of no normal function which is the same as the normal function but we are trying to use this one using this thing like function sum of a return b and it is trying to return c and it, the last one will try to add the all the arguments so in turn it will try to return this function so we can see here sum 1 2 3 to the function call to sum 1 of 2 of 3 into multiple function calls 
so one single function has been turned into a series of functions here it is normally done using the concept of closure so that the inner function can access all the its arguments so this is how we have done with carrying that is the difference between the sum of 2 comma 3 this is the most frequently asked interview question if you have any queries or any doubts you can just drop us a mail or you can comment below this video thank you